So, you guys want to learn how to do memes on your live stream, huh? Well, screw all of you, I ain't gonna teach you nothing. Why are you so mean to me? I'm just kidding. I'm gonna teach you guys exactly what to do. Let's go! Baba boy. How's it going, guys? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. My name is DeSynchro. I'm a variety streamer from the west coast of Australia, and I'm here to teach you how to do memes on your live stream. In particular, we're gonna be learning how to do this meme over here. However, by the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to make your own memes. So the next time you come across that one streamer that has a unique meme and whatnot, you won't have to be a little bit knowing that he has memes and you have no idea how to do them because you will know exactly what to do by the end of today. So, without further ado, let's head over to OBS. Oh shit, here we go again. God damn it, CJ. So here we are guys on OBS and I will show you exactly what you need to do this meme right here on your own OBS. Guys, the files for this meme will be available on my Discord. Link on the description down below. Check it out. We actually have a session on our Discord where I'm going to be uploading any files for any tutorials that we do. I will also be uploading some other cool stuff over there to help other fellow streamers as well. You're more than welcome to use them and enjoy it to your heart's content. This is my little gift to you guys. Hope you all enjoy. So guys, there are several, several different ways of adding memes to your OBS. However, the way that I'm going to be teaching you guys today is super, super simple, and that's using a simple scene switch. And the best part about this is, is that you don't even need a stream deck for it. It's also compatible with hotkeys, so you can use your mouse and keyboard as well. It's basically, you're switching to a scene when you want to show off the meme, and then once you're done with the meme, you can switch back to whatever scene you want, and it works like an absolute charm. So guys, let's get this party started. Open up your OBSs and look at that. You got your beautiful OBSs, you got your just chatting scenes, you got your gaming scenes, you're too scared to mess around with them and whatnot. That's the beauty about this method that I'm going to be teaching you guys, is the fact that you don't have to modify anything, you're only adding more to it. So head over to your scenes. Click that little plus button and let's add a new scene. So now we got a new scene, fresh new scene, nothing in it. All you guys have to do now is add a source mirror. Now basically guys, we're making a source mirror because we're going to be adding a filter to our webcams. And we're also going to be having the webcam on a different size than the original one. So add a new source mirror and link it to your webcam. Now the good part about this is whatever we do to the source mirror now is not going to affect our main camera. It's only going to apply the effect to this source mirror. You could also apply it to the scene itself. So let's right click that source mirror, go to filters, and then let's add a little color correction filter. You guys can fiddle around with this as much as you want. This is personal preference really, but I'm gonna go with my color code that I had on my original one. Increase the contrast, uh, lower the saturation down just a little bit. And there you go. Now we have a source mirror with a filter on it. We just gotta add the hearts. However, check this out guys. If you go back to your main scene and go back to the meme, you'll notice that it's only affecting the meme scene, which is what we want. So guys, the next step is adding the hearts. This is what you're going to do. You're gonna click add on your sources. You're gonna go to media sources and then you're gonna create a new uh, media source. So let's go meme hearts. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna select local file. This should be selected by default. Go to browse and select the hearts meme. And that's basically it. And I would recommend you guys actually talking on loop. Um, I usually have all my memes set on loop. So then when they ever they run out, they automatically restart. But regardless of what not, this is personal preference. So just click OK and there you go. You have the hearts in. The meme is complete, guys. That is literally it. So whenever you're on your stream right now, you go to your main camera, blah, 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 meme, blah, 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 meme. <laughs> now, one thing that you guys are probably wondering is why is it that I can't hear the meme? And that's very, very simple to fix. All you guys got to do is right click the meme hearts here, advanced audio properties, and change the audio monitoring to monitor and output. And this is gonna basically let you listen to whatever the media source uh, is playing. It's just that simple. And like I mentioned, you can be talking to your things, you simply switch scene, back to normal, let's do a quick meme, switch to the meme scene, switch back, continue doing your thing. And this also works if you're gaming too, which is absolutely awesome. So that's literally it guys. That's how simple it is to add memes to your OBS and do live edits on your live stream and whatnot. If you have a, something like a stream deck and whatnot, it's even easier to do this since you could just simply tap the button and then switch back to your thing. However, this method that I showed you doesn't need a stream deck, which is the great charm of it all. So even if you don't have something like that, you can still do it just fine. No dramas whatsoever. Guys, 
thank you so much for hanging out. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope I was able to help you guys. Come hang out with us on Twitch. I stream from Monday to Friday at 4 p.m. Australia Western Standard Time on Twitch. And I stream on Saturdays at 4 p.m. Australia Western Standard Time on YouTube. If you have any more questions and you need any help with anything, feel free to come join us. Ask questions there. I'm happy to help you guys while I'm alive. Thank you so much for being here, everybody. And I will catch you all in the next video. Love you! If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe to see more. You are now officially my little meme lords.